we are answering the question why logical reasoning will be tough in CAT 2016. Right? As you can see, we have given a classic clickbait title and we have given a clickbait heading. We have never done this in our history. We are just having a go at this. Uh, so, in classic, in any clickbait thing, we, we should ramble on about something before getting to the relevant point. Right? So, I am going to talk about a, a, a story, George Bernard Shaw and Isidora Duncan. Uh, Bernard Shaw is a famous playwright and Duncan was apparently a beautiful actress. This story is probably apocryphal. It probably did not happen. Nobody knows. Apparently, she walked up to him and said, uh, with, you, you're extremely intelligent and extremely beautiful. We should make a child together so that that will be a remarkable child if you made one. Bernard Shaw looked at her wistfully and said, what if it turned out to be the other way around? Right, so, uh, now, why am I saying all this? What is the big deal about Bernard Shaw here? Right, so, logical reasoning was tough. DILR was tougher last year than usual. Therefore, it will be even tougher this year. Right, what if it were the other way around? Right, so, there is absolutely no basis for any of these inferences any genius Tom, Dick and Harry makes on the internet. The CAT 2016 notification tells us there will be three sections. It tells us that they will be testing quant, DALR and verbal NRC. In fact, if you look at the FAQ section, they even say that there is no great defined syllabus for this exam. They are not even willing to be committed on what is the framework for this exam. How in the wide world? Can anyone make an inference whether logical reasoning or data interpretation will be tougher or easier than last year? It is, it is as likely to be tougher as it is to be easier. So don't go in for any any genius interpretation of whether the paper will be tougher or easier last year. Go in with a fairly open mind. Prepare with the framework that it is going to be broadly the same. Characters, people want to say that it is unpredictable, it has changed, it has form, shape and all kinds of stuff. It's an objective exam, which tests basic math, basic English, and basic charts and puzzle solving. It has been like that in 1990, 2000, 2010, 2015. It will be like that in 2016. These are small tweaks here and there. Some, some slight up, down, and level of difficulty, some small change in format, all of that. But the framework doesn't change. 90% of the preparation plan doesn't change. And so this, the, 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 the charter industry has a lot of fun by making predictions. None of those predictions have any validity. And so, if you must have a preconceived notion, then, then assume that it could be probably, broadly, like last year. Not because there has any merit to that statement, but then at least you're saying, look, just like last year, maybe slightly tougher, slightly easier. The most level-headed prediction that you can take into the exam hall, if you need something to anchor, anchor it with. But there is no basis to anybody claiming anything else. So, keep that in mind. Don't let somebody put notions in your head and go in expecting a monstrous paper. Last year, the paper was supposed to be fabulously tough because it was set by I'm Ahmedabad. <laughs> and then the paper was easier than what you had seen as an average for the last the five years before that. And so these people talk out of their head. There is if something official comes from the IIM saying this is what we intend CAT to be, then take it seriously. Everything else, have a laugh. Right? As, as, the, as, the, as the statement goes, you go in expecting logical reasoning to be tougher. What if it were the other way around? It could easily be easier. And so, so don't take any of these statements too seriously.